What's up, Genzy peeps? Welcome to the first episode of Podcast Your New Gen. So today, we are going to be talking about cancel culture. The ins and outs of it. So Mika, anong masasabi mo sa viewers natin? Like, can you tell them a little bit? Like, pahapyaw about cancel culture? Well, so basically, cancel culture is the Gen Z's version of boycotting. Kasi boycotting is so, so, so 1990 and so millennial. So, ano, Marga, any thoughts on cancel culture? Alam nyo, I think for today's episode, yung cancel culture that we're talking is in general. Pero, I think we all know that there's like different categories of cancel culture. Kasi especially us in our age. And... Lagi tayong lulong sa, ano, lulong? lulong. Sa social media. <laughs> 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 Daily <laughs> newspaper natin ng social media. So, yeah. like, low-key normalized siya. Mm, parang ano siya, eh, parang eh. we can survive without, ano, yung social media. Kaya, mm-hmm. everyday, nakakita tayo ng... Pero do you guys agree sa concept ng cancel culture? I think, mm-hmm. ano, Ako, there's... Uh, may, tayo magkakaalaman. May binabagayan siya. Like, ina, may inaayon siyang situation. Oo, tama, may tama. appropriate Uh-oh. na pag-cancel. For me, okay naman siya. Pero iba kasi may, mm-hmm. medyo... Alam mo, overboard na. Pero ako, for me, in general, it's okay. Cancel culture. Mm-hmm. Though, parang siyang ano, parang siyang pang na yeah. sa mga oh, yeah. netizens. Oh, yes. oh, oh. Pampatakot na siya like, uy, wag kang mag ganyan makakancel ka. Like, lagi natin ginagamit yung phrase, makakancel na ako. Na oh. like, and what I mean by inappropriate is that other types of, ano, yung parang other instances of pag-cancel ay hindi talaga makatarungan eh. Like for someone, for example, someone doesn't like hamburgers, you're gonna tell your friend, uy, bakit hamburgers yung like niya? Di ba dapat hot dogs? Di ba Marga? No. <laughs> oh, tama, tama. And then you're gonna tell them, uy, unfollow him or mm. her kasi he likes this or that. Even though, hindi naman, hindi naman talaga, ano eh, tao dito. Opinion niya lang naman Opinion yun. Opinion niya lang naman talaga yun and they shouldn't be entitled naman sila in their own opinions to their own opinions rather. But though, on that note, minsan talaga mga opinion parang, parang hindi na siya opinion. Uh-oh. Parang you're blatantly na lang. discriminating. Oh, you're, you're blatantly telling a lie. Parang Uh-oh. you're Yun. just putting it out Uh-oh. there na something that's oppositely Uh-oh. right. Ganun. Oh, and parang, then they're correcting you. Tapos you're parang utterly believing the lie. Parang talaga. Parang hindi. Parang, pinipilit mo pa rin yung sayo. Uh-oh. Parang ganun. It's ridiculous at times. Doon Char- kumapasok like yung hindi naman kagandahan. Yung parang, yung benefits of cancel culture when it comes to affecting the mindset of no. all, it, it especially your mindset. people our age. Parang, oh. nag-iingat na talaga oh. sila ngayon. Like, before, makita mo, ang daming... Reckless yung mag-post oh, oh. talaga. Oh, yes. May racist oh, oh. comments sa... Oh, oh. Sexist. Ano, panigan talaga ng Ages. panigan. Kahit mm. ano talaga. Pero syempre ngayon, medyo delikado rin siya kasi nga, mm-hmm. one wrong move. Why? Tayo kasi mga Gen Z's, we love to jump into conclusion oh. agad-agad. And tayo agad, like, we like to cancel basta-basta without, without, like, checking kung ano talaga yung facts, gano'n. Maaari tayo maka-damage ng reputation if hindi tayo careful. Kaya, Kahit hindi naman talaga oh, dapat. Yeah. Kahit hindi naman talaga deserve nung tao. For example, hindi yung ginawa tapos kinancel siya bigla. Kasi may mga myths, accusations. Siyempre, uso na ngayon ng chismis sa social media. Oh, true. Mabilis kumalat. Especially on Twitter, Facebook. Instagram. Oo. Oh, oh. Especially Facebook. 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 I, for me, Twitter ang malala. Like, mm. especially, like, there's different branches of Twitter naman, di ba? Uh, like, there's Stan Tweet. Merong personal know. Twitter. Like, uh, maraming, maraming branches of Twitter, if uh, you know what I mean. So, like, if you know, you know. <laughs> Kaya ako lumi pa sa threads, eh. Dahil sa... <laughs> parang, ano na siya, like, one wrong move, especially on Stan Tweet. Stan Tweet? Stan Tweet. On Stan Tweet, like, parang... One wrong opinion about unser- a certain idol. Para no, followers mo don't make no, one day. Oh, 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 may kwento ako dyan. Mm-hmm. May kwento ako dyan Sige since da? I'm on stan tweet talaga. Like, kung kung ito yung mangyayari, kunyari, halos araw-araw may makita kang makakancel. Like, uh, user, ex- exposing user blank blank. Mm-hmm. Then na, oh. resibo. Tapos, screenshot. Screenshots, oh, screenshot. convos. Tapos, ala, pwede na lang kinano, kinkall out ng privately. Need pa i-ano. Mm. Like, ipakalanda ka Kasi, na. And tawag ah, cancel cancel yung taong yung to public pero public trial by ano public, uh, public, public execution publicity, oh. uh, publicity yun. Tayo pa naman mga Gen Z's mga palaban tayo no. Yung mob oh, mentality oh. is iba like Hindi very yan tayo. Hindi tayo magpapatalo. Tapos talaga. minsan pa like when they call out mali pa pala yung kinakol. Yun. Oh, exactly. Mali pa pala yung pagkain. Totoo, totoo, totoo. So yun yung like downsides of cancel culture. Mm-hmm. Pero yung benefits, ano sa tingin niyo? Like aside from nababago yung mentality nila. Parang, benefits. aside from nagiging cautious sila, what do you think? Ano pa? 
for others, sa tingin ko, it prompts them to change their mindset into and develop into someone with a better mindset. I a think better ano, beliefs. Kasi nga, mm-hmm. minsan pag nakorek ka, may mga tao talaga na pag nakorek, ano sila eh, tanggap nila, like they are willing to learn, willing oh, to tama, change, tama. to be better. But also, there are, yung mga may yins and yangs, ang yang, yung, yang ba yung color, color black? Oo, black. Oh, black. Oh, sa yung yang, yeah. nung, yeah. sa yung good yeah. side, yeah. yung learning, yeah. yung, yung person na willing to learn, yung, yung yang side nun ay, someone who's not willing to learn, mm-hmm. and someone who's not willing to change. Kaya doon tayo nagkakaproblema kasi nga aaway nila yun. Mm-hmm. Pero kung doon naman sa yen, good good thing siya for me kasi nga yun na nga kung yung opinion mo ay tainted, then you are taught an opinion or rather something that will change your opinion into something Ooh. better. Gets mo ba? Yeah. Oo, oh, oh, tama. Kasi <laughs> oms, ano oms? <laughs> <laughs> Tsaka ano? Kaya kasi si ganito, pinapaliwanan kasi ano, kayo, pag, kapag manunong ka tumba, ano, tumanggap ng constructive criticisms, it, ano, tumutulong siya sa pag-improve ng hindi lang ng minds mo, pero yung buong pagkatao mo. Kasi you're looking both sides nung, ano, nung argument. Like, mm-hmm. ito yung bad side ng argument. Then, ito yung good side. Kasi isipin mo, pag hindi mo tinanggap yung either side nung argument, may ang mangyayari doon, parang, sabi natin, mas siguro, uh, gumuka kang masama kasi pinagpipilitan mo talaga na hindi talaga na pwede to pero hindi naman talaga mm-hmm. like that. Kaya, kailangan mo talagang look both sides then ac- ano, accept ng uh, good criticism. Mm-hmm. Alam mo, Alexa, di ba sabi nila, a better mind means a better you, a better you means better friends around you, and a better friends around you means a better environment and overall, a better life for you. Tama, tama. Pero like, so, joke lang. On that note, when it comes to benefits of cancel culture, I think it educates people. It educates people. Parang Uh-oh. like, hindi lang, tulad nga ng sinabi ni TK about sa yin and yang, like, mm. once nagkamali ka, you're, when, once you're willing to learn nga, parang may educate mo, maiba talaga yung mindset mo, maiba yung point of view mo, oh. at saka, yung kagandahan ba na matatakot ka? <laughs> matatakot oh. ka! Oh. Tsaka na-expose ka sa iba't ibang consequences. For example, if I do this, ay, oh my God, ito yung consequences. Oo, oh, oh, like, makakancel ako. Oh. At saka, one thing, once it's on the internet, it stays there. Oh. Forever so, na yan. Uh, oh, so, yun right. din yung parang one of the fears of the netizens na once na makancel sila, masasearch mo yan mm. on Google. Oh. Like, oh. Halong lagi, ka talaga oh, siya. Oh, lang especially lagi, celebrities. Hashtag mo lang yan sa oh, Twitter. Oh, Lalo na pag may ano sila, like inappropriate videos, ganun. Eh, oh, hinalong ka mm. talaga. Tsaka nadadamay pati yung family. Yun ang pangit. Family. Oh. Tapos hinahalungkat pa ng mga like bashers. Like, mm. remember oh. back in 2012? Oh, yun oh. yung oh. Ganun yung oh, nangyari. Never forget. Mm-mm. Pero yung comment nila, never forget ti. Mamaya, mag, like, ma-surprise nila nasa, nasa ano ka pa, like, nasa Reddit ka na nakapost. Oh, oh. Meron ka ng ano dun. Ang tawag dun sa Reddit ka na dun. Oh, oh. Na puro Reddit. ikaw na yun naman. Oh, may mga threads, like, podcast yeah. yarn. Ano? Yun. <laughs> Tapos ihalungkat talaga nila. Like, may, may makikita kang tweet talaga na thread. Like, 10-page thread na. <laughs> Ma picture screenshots. Sa so, ganun, ganun. You why, said this 10 years ago. Why this celebrity should be cancelled back in 2012. Ganun yung nangyari. Like, and sometimes kasi yung, yung celebrity na yan, nag-apologize na. They yeah. already Tapos, clarified uh, their mistake. Maybe they've sila. grown, di ba? Pero, hindi, halong katin pa ng tao. Pero, again, pagdating naman sa point of view na tao, they never know whether or not like, bumago na ba yung celebrity na yun. Hmm. So, that's why hinahalong kat nila, pinapaalala nila and all that pero when it comes naman to the celebrity sa tingin niyo ba like nagbago ba sila for me kasi ano eh nagbabago naman talaga ang ipangin oh, feeling ko depende hindi forever ganyan kuwari kung oh. from the beginning you're so bad talaga you're so evil i think kung makulong ka naman parang kung ano ba yung concept oh. Sabi pa- nabago ka ano, you'll be better prof namin sa philosophy people change like yung mindset nila na change oh, 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 oh. lahat talaga social cultures beliefs nag change talaga sila so we can't really say na hindi nag change ang isang celebrity hindi especially Tsaka, kung marami na influence sa kanya from oh. them from thir- 2013 sila pa din yung now from 2020 oh. siguro man nakakapag contemplate na sa ginagawa oh. yan di ba so Tsaka, i think ano yun. malay mo yung mindset nila sa atin nung mga nung mga time ng 2010 si si basak mm. mindset na nila ngayon kasi nga nag-iba iba din yung mga nakikita natin sabi atin nung katulad ng sabi ni Miko kanina na yung cancel culture is like boycotting na boycotting means the very 1990s pero kaya sa atin cancel culture na parang mas call out na talaga mm-hmm. kaya yung mga opinion nila noon nung 20 nung around 2010 noong 2010 sa nag-exist kaya pag siguro in-apply nila sa 
yung opinion nila na yon ngayon sa 20, sa culture natin mga 2020s. Invalid siya. Oo, magiging invalid do siya. Kaya sabi natin, nagbabago, may mga chessin talaga na nagbabago yung mga tao. Lalo-lalo na that oh. change is constant. constant. Oh, oh. Our standards are not constant. Oh, It changes. Beliefs yeah, are not constant. What we say right now are... May change in the future. And what, we, what we believe right now are not the same things that we are going to say and believe two years from now. Mm. Five diba? years oh, from tama. now, ten years from now. Mm-mm. Ganun din sa friends natin. Lahat din, politically, spiritually, lahat din Colleagues. Tama. It's not constant. The only constant thing is in this world is change. Yan talaga yan. Hanggang ngayon, pangangatawa ng kwena, change is the only constant thing in this world. Kaya guys, kung mga 10 years ago na yun, 1990s, huwag nyo na ano, anong katin yan? Kasi Oo, it's irrelevant yan. na yun. Iba na yun pa na nila. Unless, unless pinaniniwalaan pa din. Oo, oh, oh, at least it's still relevant. And unless kung yung kasalanan na yun is like heavy oh, oh. na kasalanan, yun talaga yung proof na. Dahil ako physically oh, or something or like emotional na nakadamage, yun ang... hindi siya pwede tolerate dapat. Immoral. Pero, yung, oh, pero kung ano mga political views or something like that, huwag po na halong katin yan, tagal-tagal na yun. Kung baga, oh, panahon pa ni Kopong-Kopong yan, ano yun mo ba? What's Kopong-Kopong? It's like a, a, an old, an, an an old term, kung baga. Parang uh-uh. sinauna, kung baga. Uh-uh. Ganun siya, yung Kopong-Kopong. Mm, very, very old. Yung mga ginagamit natin, 19 Kopong-Kopong. Tulad ngayon, yung boycotting. Mas na yung uh-uh. naging cancel, ganun. Actually, boycotting, I think, is a millennial term. Mil- isa uh-uh. ngayon yung term. Yung Kopong-Kopong is also like, I think that's, ano na? Parang, nasa ano na doon? Parang nasa... Boomer. Boomer? Sorry. Boomer. Yeah, boomer era, parang ganun. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Pero, for wait. boomers na po siya. Yeah. Parang ganun so, din, like, ganun wait, din wait, yung standards. Wait. Sa tingin niyo, like... Uy, may fishbowl nga pala tayo. Gusto niyo bumunit. Oo, oh, gusto kong bumunit. Yeah. Sige, bunit ka. Okay. Hindi, si Miko. Ay, kasi si siya yung kumuha ng bowl. Ah, si Miko. <laughs> so, Pinasa. bunit tayo ng first question. Oh. First Hello, question. Hello, yan? What is the role of social media on cancel culture? Ooh. Oh, Marga, first. Uy, na na naman. <laughs> <laughs> so, cancel culture on social media, I think, tulad nga nung sinabi natin kanina, it has... Na, na, lagi tayong nasa social media. Ikaw, ilang hours ka sana sa Twitter? Twitter, at least two. Tapos, threads five. Facebook, six. Ikaw? Twitter? Mm. Alo, active ako dyan. Sobrang active ni TK sa Twitter. Hi! Anyway, ano, siguro two uh, hours lang. Ikaw? Wala. Two to four. <laughs> Kaya sasabi ko sa last time tweet. Oo, oh, oh, yeah. daily newspaper ko ang Twitter. Twitter no, must replace to YouTube, man. kumbaga. Like, I think, ano talaga, sa pagdating sa social media, I think yung cancel culture super duper relevant siya in platforms like Twitter and Facebook lang. Oh, tama, tama. Ay, and TikTok. Isama na din natin. Ay, oh, oh, TikTok. TikTok. Yes. TikTok. Oh my God. I think it really does... play a big role. Parang mm-hmm. especially, sa TikTok kasi, yun yung Facebook natin. In my opinion, very, ano yun yung Facebook uh-oh. ng Gen Z. Like, TikTok. nakita ko sa TikTok, yun yung nangyari. Like, we, ano, we tend to believe agad when it comes to TikTok. And then when you uh-oh. say, uh, this just in, si ganyan, ito ginawa, tapos, yun na, kakancel na siya. Ang daming... Saka diba sa Twitter, yung mga pinapost sa screenshots, mostly from TikTok din ang Yes, oo, oh, 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 totoo, totoo. Oh, oh, oh. So in summary, yung opinion natin ay social media plays a significant role. Oo. Mm-hmm. And then, parang siyang nagiging crab mentality. Is mm, the term correct? Yeah. Parang hindi, you know, hindi, hindi crab ano bang mentality. Hindi, iba yung crab mentality. Parang inaano siya, like, nagiging general opinion na siya ng lahat. Opinion niya, naging Wait. opinion na ng lahat. Parang naging uh, universal. Like, for example, oh, yung isang kasis, sa kanila daw yung purple. Parang, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I, don't want to oh, yeah, I remember it. it. Oo. Oh, oh. Para makakancel tayo parang tayo ano, dyan. Parang ano, hindi yan, hindi. Yeah, yan ang effects of cancel culture. Oh, like, yeah. you're oh. afraid to speak up in ways na, you try to sur- oh. suppress your opinions na, y- there's no parang, Free of speech? Freedom of speech? Freedom of speech. In a way, you are now so scared, scared of expression. Because you're scared your reputation is on the line palagi. Pag may so, uh, next Wait, although, in addition to that, although, when it comes to freedom of speech, I think people should always, like, think oh, before they worry. speak. Like, hindi Uh-oh. lang yung basta... Bira ka na ng bira. Bira, tat, 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 ano. Mmm. Okay. Ikaw na. Hindi. Alex. Ako na. Ako na. Ah, sige. Uy, apat to. Sakto to sa atin. Yeah, swakto yan. Walang magda-dodge. What are the advantages and disadvantages of cancel culture? Okay, bigay tayo tatlo each. As like, tatlo? tatlong, ano? Advantage. Tatlong. I think konti lang yung, oh, ano? Simulan mo. Konti lang siya. Like, like, lahat na tayo doon. Ah, sige, sige. Ah. Sino mauna? Sige, ako na. Siguro sa advantages, para sa akin, yung... 
tao na kanya sabi din yung nakakancel. Baka nas, na-educate siya. Mm-hmm. Na iniisip niya, hala baka tong opinion ko is not acceptable. Or may mali akong nasabi kaya need ko uh, i-understand more yung topic na to. Para malaman ko kung saan nang kagala yung sinasabi ng mga nagka-cancel sa akin ganon. Sa akin naman, sa disadvantages ay may mga tao na nakakancel na hindi naman nila deserve. They get cancelled for just expressing themselves. Kahit tama naman, wala namang wrong doon. Pero like, against lang siya sa beliefs ng others, that's why he or she is getting cancelled. For me, sa advantages is nakakapag arista yung awareness. Especially sa mga taong like, alam mo yun, hindi aware sa paligid nila. Self-awareness. <laughs> nakakapag-educate tayo, nakakapag-tulong tayo sa ibang tao and stuff like that. Pero for disadvantage naman, I think, yung reputation ng kinakancel talaga, no? Kawawa naman yung kinakancel. Oo, 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 tama. Tsaka ako, ako sa disadvantage, lalo na kung nag-express lang naman ng opinion yung tao. Hmm. Like, wala, ano, wala namang say-say na ba't mo siya ikakancel? If opinion niya lang naman talaga yun. Tsaka, At, unless na mayroon siya oh, sa opinion oh. niya. Hmm. Diba? Another advantage, well, for me, on my opinion, na advantage <laughs> siya, when it comes to canceling a person or like a certain celebrity with a large following, parang especially... Example, Andrew Tate. Mm-hmm. Ganon, like, yeah. especially with a person with a large following that spews nonsense at ang dami pang sumusunod. Like, ang daming nagpa-follow. Ang daming daming, oh, oh, totoo. Ang daming supporters. They're and, almost like loyalists. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The benefits Apologies of that, the benefits of that is once they're canceled, like, people start to see or realize uh-oh. Yes. Uh-oh. Ay, how, how ang, ano niya pala, like, uh-oh. how a person of he, he is. Yung, like, yung ganun. Yung pinaka-character talaga. Mm-hmm. Like, gumalabas yung true colors. And then, like, parang, nawawalan talaga sila ng follow ng following oh, na naubusan sila ng followers ba- nakikita mo rin oh, bababa which talaga which suppresses like the mentality spreading ganun parang mm. I think that's one of the benefits no, of cancel culture it. like nasa suppress niya yung kamalian ganun okay next next ako na ba? oo ikaw, oh, ikaw na magbunod sige na ako na muna oh, special kasi si Marga oh. yeah. 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 special siya kaya no pala pinakamahirap na question <laughs> <laughs> na sa akin oh, sana sagot, no? <laughs> sabi dito how do these No, how does cancel culture affect the mindset of a person? So, for me, ito yung kay Miko kanina, yung kanina pa din discuss ni Marga, yung takot ng mag-express oh. na opinion kasi nga, in fear of being canceled, canceled and constructive. No, not constructive. It's actually destructive criticism oh, sa lagay na to. Kasi nga, wala nang sense kung bakit mo siya ika-cancel if opinion naman nila yun. And tama naman, unless they are racist, sexist, ageist, or... Uh-oh. Ano ba? Ano ba ba? Homophobic. Abusive. Homophobic. Misogynist. Misogynist. Yun. Madami pang iba. Narcissist. <laughs> Et cetera. Narcissist? Narcissist? Sige. Saan? Alam binanggit na lang. Alam binanggit. Lato na gano'n. Inis na isa. Hindi siya lang tama. Your turn. Hello. Girl, your turn yet. Hello. For the last question. Pa-special kasi siya. Ano to? Contestant number Ay, one. What are your thoughts on cancel culture? Hello. Sige. Ito kasi. Ito na lang din yung take away natin. Oo. Sige. Take away na rin natin. I think cancel culture talaga, it it benefits and it has its downsides. Oo, yin totoo, and yang. Kahit anong gawin mo, it will be there. I feel like kahit in all ages talaga, oh. like kahit dati pa, kahit ngayon, cancel culture exists way before. Oh. Nag-iba oh, lang yung term, oh. ano? Mm, well, nag-iba lang before, yung term. Oh. And I think cancel culture is like a reminder for us that mm. we have to keep our crap together. Uh-oh. We have Uh-oh. to keep our like mentality like clean and Uh-oh. how Uh-oh. we avoid. And then we have to think before we speak. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. We post good. For so, me naman, I think para na surprise rin yung ego ng isang tao. For example, kung egoistic ka, cancel culture will mga parang will shut you up <laughs> kasi mm-hmm. kung if you're sample, masyado kang mabunga nga, masyado kang alam mo yun. Uh-oh. Uh, combative, palaaway ka ganun. Parang mapadalong isip ko should I do this or not? Kasi baka makancel ako yung ganun mga term. Kaya I think nakakadisiplina rin siya ng tao, yung cancel culture. Mm-hmm. Sa akin naman, cancel culture, siguro papasok dito yung ano, isa pang natatanda ko palaging, palaging binabanggit, yung think before you click. Mm. Mm. Like always dub, ano, like double check mo yung mga terms na sasabihin mo, mga words na gagamitin mo, kasi di natin sure baka itong gagamitin mo is makaka-offend doon sa tao. Mm. Na kala mo, pagising mo na, pagising mo, nakita mo, Hala, famous ka na. Pero nakita mong ratioed ka na. Nakita <laughs> mo na ano na, 30K. Quote, quote, retweet. 50, 50 likes. Yun pala, cancelled ka na pala. So yeah, guys. 
Always think before you click. Oh so our takeaways for today in summary, I think before you click at think before you speak. Again, I am TK, you're always a okay host. I'm Alexa, your resident Alina, pwede mo kausapin anytime, anywhere. And of course, ako si Miko, ang queer niyong kahit kailan, hindi na abusan ng kwento. And this is Marga, your friendly neighborhood host. So guys, please don't forget to like and follow our Facebook page. Yan, para like kayong updated sa freshest and newest content from Black Screen Productions. Don't forget to subscribe and turn that notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa aming mga newest episode under Black Screen Productions. You guys can also now find us at Spotify at Podcast Yarn. See you on the next episode of... Podcast Yarn New Gen! Welcome to another episode of... Podcast Yarn New Gen! So like today's episode, we're going to explore our preferences in relationships. Uy! 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 tunay na kulay ng mga host ng Podcast Yarn New Gen. I think for me, it's gonna be a smash. Why? I mean, I have a reason behind it naman. And what's that reason? Kasi he's a 10. <laughs> <laughs> Ayan! May ano ako eh. May, may ano kasi ako. Yung, yung friends ko nag... Ano, mm. male, and, male and blue women is equal lang. Yung, yung POV! Ano yung POV? Alam ko yung POV. Alam mo yun. Alam, alam mo yun. Yung guy na nag-tiktok POV na GBF tapos lagi siya nakawig. <laughs> Unless ganun ka na. Shoutout po sa mga GBF dyan. For me, it's a pass. I'm sorry. I know, I know to my friends, I used to vape. I am ashamed of it. It was a dark time. I was with the wrong friends, wrong people, wow. wrong habits. Guys, I, I, I promise, character matters. Chaka, always set your standards.